Sun's out. <sighs> Straight back into it, bashing out two videos this week. Um, bashing out, it's a, a funny expression. Um, so where we're at with the team so far. Oh, no, let's do comments first, let's do comments. Thank you very much for your comments this week. Um, it's good that you're getting involved. We're in it together, kind of. Um, so we'll start, by the way, I'll, I'll, everybody who sends comments in, there's sort of run, it's like, for example, this guy. Love the video, started to practice save myself because of this channel. Don't give players without a club a signing on fee. Good advice. They will 95 out of 100 times sign without a fee. Keep pumping out the videos. Pump it, pump it. Anyway, this guy's from a guy called Peter Thousand Rasmussen. He sounds like a player on Championship Manager. Like, Ra. Rasmussen. Look, oh, oh, there's loads. <laughs> Although, saying that, there's a Fletcher. He's alright. 20. Although, them stats could be shoddy. Um, so thank you, Peter. You sound Norwegian. Loving the videos, mate. Keep them coming. Thank you, Mark. Oh, this is a controversial one from Leonardo Scaranto. Again, sounds like a Chapman player. Sal Carboni. Too expensive for the club for it as a sub. Then get Victor Aristazabal. Petrino. Petri I know I know for a fact Aristazabal is not on because I've already searched for him. Petrino. Florin between you at Maven, Maidenhead? How is he playing for Maidenhead with six caps? Weird. It's alright though. It's alright. Uh, Marco Negri and McKinley. Cheers from Brazil. Thank you. Uh, it's from Kevin Hatton. For player recommendations, Hugo Pinero. I already looked at him, but I've already got my Greek keeper in, mate, so I don't need a keeper. Elder Hadzmiazanizavizavizavich. Oh, where's he gone? Now, I do know about this guy. Elder Hadzi me me to bet as a bitch. I'm going to bid for him. 11 appearances, 13 goals, 9 assists. He's worthy of a bid, but he's at 600k. Wow. They'll well, 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 accept that. Um, anybody else? Um, oh, apparently there's a way to update to the latest uh, database or to fix the patch. And no, so you, you fix the patch, but you keep to the database. That's from Kevin Hatton as well. I might do that. So if it crashes, there's a chance I could still rescue the game. Dude, search for Skelidis. He plays for Hania. Um, thank you, Sam. Then he puts balls. <clears throat> just, just seen the video. You've already explained the Greeks. Don't. Um, Sam, are you American? Uh, yeah, it looks like the Greek superstars aren't on this version you're playing. It was Christmas 2000 update. Yep, yeah, thank you, GRK again. Um, Thomas Asheraf cashing on carbon. That's two people have said it now. Uh, this is a good nice one. As soon as I saw your video, I did a Bradford City save, came third in Division 1 and won the FA Cup. What the hell? From Villa Magic 82. You won the FA Cup with Bradford in the first season. You had Sigalco, London, Mark, uh, Plumbing, it was Mirage. He's all right, isn't he, Mirajo? He surely you don't get a work permit. Surely. Um, and I apologise for the buzzing on the last episode. It was very buzzy and echoey. I'm sorry. I'm not. I'm not Steven Spielberg. Uh, next match is home to Preston. Let's crack on. Oh, John Gregory's gone. Who's my assistant manager? Oh, Stuart McCorpler, of, of course, I knew that already. Look at this for a backroom. Once these re retire, I'll have McCall and Speed in my backroom team. As coaches. Phew. Oh. Jao uh, Piver's going to bomb if he rejected Bradford. Oh. Oh. Not bother, mate. Oh. We can speak to him. I don't think he'll come, though. From Brazil, he won't get a work permit. Not, not gonna happen. Oh my god! What the hell? Oh, that's that's a dangling carrot. That bad timing, though, isn't it? If if Weatherall's in, if West injured, but I think Weatherall's a good defender, but he's not he's not the best defender. Let's just see what else is out there. 
Gary Rowett, no thanks. Oh. He's alright, isn't he? Raymond Keller. Extrema. Extremadura. Where do they play? In Spain. I like him. I like him. I like him a lot. I like his anticipation and balance. Really good at balancing. And strength. He'll be a good defender, him. Bishkilov. I can't really... I can't afford to buy him. But if I sell... Carboni, I could get Caller in. Um, oh, blooming it. Could they willing to exchange anybody? Oh, this is a dilemma, isn't it? What would you do? What would you have done? That was probably not good enough. Heading 10, jumping 12. I've got rid of Atherton. I've got nobody in my reserves. We can sell Aidan Davison. We don't need him anymore. Um, oh, what to do? I need time. I'm delaying my decision. Oh, why did I give up on him? Why I just wait a couple of weeks? It doesn't matter. They're desperate. They're that desperate for a centre half. Got Herman O'Reilly. Oh, bloody hell. Could have got a million for Weatherall. I'm never going to get a million for Weatherall again, am I? Obviously. Right, anyway, let's concentrate on the, on the football. Right, uh, Speed Wally Calstrom. Carboni is going. He's going. Um, which will hopefully free up room then. To bring in Hadzimian and Mirich. Should I give him one last bite of the cherry? Because McCall's Calstrom's unfit. So let's put him in for Calstrom. Um, and he's got one last shot. This is his last chance. His whole career at Bradford City is riding on this one game. Every time. Pressing any good? Like, what we got going on here? Kevin Gallagher. The Kevin Gallagher. Wow. 34. Tepe. Tepe, isn't it? Tepe. The problem is now, I bet Weatherall has a stinker because his, his head will be elsewhere. McCall. Come on, McCall. Tommy, dear. I bet McCall. Oh, Gary Speed with the assist. Bloody hell, Speed. Do a few more passes in the first 18 minutes. No pressure, Carboni, but this is your chance. I've dropped Carlstrom because he's unfit for you. So you better bloody do something. And also, pressing a crap. It's clear to see pressing a crap. I want at least over 40 passes and assist five key passes or a goal from Carboni or he's off. Did you get all that? I knew McCall, I knew whether I'll be having a stinker. Because he's thinking, oh, Ipswich, oh, I'd like to, oh, I'd like it on the north at Broad on a little boat. Exactly what he's thinking. Oh, get a bit, bit more money. Money, oh, Carboni! Right, it was knackered. McCall's having a rest. But I haven't got a sub to bring up for McCall. Duff play there. Uh, why, why won't it let me sub? Oh, Victory, DMC. Go on, Jim Victory. I've got to admit, a bit of me, a bit of me wanted to sell Carboni. A lot of me, actually. It's kind of ruined it a bit for me. How many key passes? Only one key pass. 
45 passes though, he did that for me. And he scored the goal. I can't, surely I can't sell him. But I can't have him coming off Ben Jiver. And Karlstrom's nine, with nine assists. Now, there is another, another issue here. Gareth Wally hasn't scored in a while. Albeit he's got nine goals this season. A way to drill him in the next game. Um, so we'll see, we'll see. There might be room there for Karlstrom to go into the middle. And Carboni will be put on the wing then. work it gets in the way doesn't it right Lee Makel's contract not bothered uh, not really bothered about Lee Makel in fact Let's try and cash in on Merkel. Burnley, get in. Um, just because I'm, 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 it's getting congested now in, in that midfield. Um, Adam Ard is probably not going to get looking in. He's good out of reserves. Uh, we've got Klaus Beck who's back up. We've got Ian Jess who we're forgetting about. In fact, I do like Ian Jess. And I loved him in real life. But I, he's 30 years old. He's not going to get a sniff on this game. He needs to go. And that should free up a bit of money then. Just to bring in these extra players. Bring in that centre half that I liked. I like the look of. See, he were, he were about a million, wasn't he? Um, oh, right. Obviously, they're going to offer a contract to him. <sighs> QA have won a game of football. This is how good QA are. They don't have a single player in highlight. Like, like for me, don't, what, I'm not bothered. What? Why does? Why? Why? Why does that bother me? That Kuwait qualified. I've won in the World Cup qualifying section against Iraq. Oh, I'd love. A, I'd love a sign in Iraqi. Jalal, I remember him at Tottenham. Honestly, don't. I'm not bothered. Right. So, Kalstrom's back in for obvious reasons. Um. Carbone is back to the bench. It's a way to Gillingham. And Gillingham, if I remember rightly, have Marlon King, who was a very good player. Uh, young Luke Wiltshire, who would grew up to be alright. Um, who else did they have? Andy Hessenthaler. So Andy Hessenthaler is 36 in this game. Imagine how old he is now. He must be like 60. Uh, ended up being not, not a bad manager actually, Andy Hessen Tyler. Uh, how did Chiotis do last game? Oh, standard seven. In fact, all my defence did really well, other than Weatherall. Mental block. Also, Weatherall happens to be one of the most intelligent football players in the world. Uh, he's got like a master's degree. Come on, lads. Be a tough game, but it's definitely winnable. Winnable. You could have argued, I could have kept the same team with Carboni in it. But the, the stats don't lie. Oh, yeah. Oh, bloody Marlon King. You know what? I'm, I'm missing Trebo West. Even though... Hang on. This is about to dwindle out for me now, if I don't make a change. Carboni, get up front. Do your stuff. <laughs> He's bloody done it again, his lad. He's bloody done it. He's got me a point against a very crap chilling and we're second from the bottom. Oh, God, you absolute. Three points behind Wolves, though. 
Oh, who got the assist? Seriously, guys. Seriously. Bakalik Loglu assist. Carboni goal. Two in the most influential subs you'll see. Oh, God. On, on, honestly. The board better happy with a point. Like what what's happened to Gareth Wally? He's just dried up. Yeah, the, the first nine games of the season, he was flying. And we've got the League Cup in four days. Away to Derby. Derby, who were in the Prem at this point. Uh, they've got the likes of Ravenelli. You remember Ravenelli? Uh, Dion Burton, he wouldn't have won. Uh, Branko Strupa, Craig Burley, these are like legend. Malcolm Christie, young Malcolm Christie went to play for Middlesbrough. Um, you know, I think I would have been for the Derby team, but this is kind of a legendary Derby team. Um, so, yeah, that'll do. Thank you for watching. Uh, next video banged out fr Friday, a bit of a wobble. Um, yeah, subscribe, comment. <clears throat> Goodbye.